guys, it's G Money here, also known as Gavin Smith, and you're watching The Blind Runner, and man, man, oh man, oh man, do we have a great video for you tonight, as I run a time two mile, was a hat, was a mile warm up, and then two miles of hill training after my time two mile, and uh, yeah, and then the cool down, and then we might do some, we're gonna do some plyos afterwards, um, but yeah, I'm gonna get warmed up, and um, but first I want to tell you guys something. Recently I've been getting a lot of complaints about, like, uh, people are asking me, how come you don't put, f put footage of your running in your videos? And, I'm, and, uh, my answer is, is because I don't have a filmer, and it kind of looks bad if I, if I, if I record it, because, you know, my camera's, uh, moving up and down like crazy. But we're actually going to put some footage in there today, maybe about... 15 seconds to 30 seconds of my time two mile and then um, We're gonna actually put like two minutes to five minutes of my uh, hill training And uh, yeah, it should be a pretty good day. I mean and it should be a pretty good video. I hope you guys like it. Yeah um, But let's get started. I'm gonna go get warmed up and then We're gonna bike there. Uh, it's a mile and a half away. I measured out a certain road So yeah, we're gonna bike there um, yeah, get, I'm gonna get warmed up. Found you when your heart was broke. I filled your cup until it overflowed. Took it so far to keep you close. I was afraid to leave you on your own. I said I'd catch you if you fall. If they laugh, then fuck them all And then I got you off your knees Put you right back on your feet Just so you could take advantage of me Tell me how's it feel Sitting up there Feeling so high But too far away to hold me You know I'm the one who put you up there Name in the sky Does it ever get lonely Thinking you could live It's a mile and a half away. It's a road I measured out, and we're gonna use my bike. All right, talk to you guys later. And this will be our ride there. All right, let's get moving. time two mile and um it was 14 10 i want to say not my best but i wasn't familiar with the road so yeah um we're gonna go out for hill training now talk to you guys later
just got done with 2.15 five miles hill training and was that and the two time two mile and 0.88 miles of my warm up was actually 0.88 miles 88 miles and uh yeah with all that that's a little bit over five miles today and that's going to leave me at 30 on the week my week starts on friday and ends on thursday kind of weird but that's just how i set it up so that's 30 miles this week and 31 miles last week 61 miles the last two weeks pretty solid you know pretty good and uh uh, now we're going to do some plyos, and then we're going to wrap it up with our um, daily news and some birthday shout-outs. So I just got done with plyos, and I forgot to record. Um, no big deal. They're not that, even that hard. So I just did three sets of ten calf raises. Uh, last one you got to hold for ten seconds, and jump squats, three sets of twelve. And then a plank for 60 seconds. And then a left and the right 45 second uh, side bridge. And then three sets of 30 glute kicks. Um, three sets of 30 second mountain climbers. And, uh, um, and then long jump pops, three sets of 10. And now it's time for your daily news. And this goes to all you sports fans out there. Um... And the Houston Texans fans of the NFL. But there are trade rumors going around about your quarterback, Deshaun Watson, getting traded to the New England Patriots. What? What are you guys doing? Seriously. Um, you already traded your best wide receiver, one of the best wide receivers in the NFL, to the Arizona Cardinals, named DeAndre Hopkins. And, uh... For a washed up running back named David Johnson that only had one good year. So what are you guys doing? And now you want to trade your one of the, probably the top 15, uh, one of the top 15 quarterbacks in the NFL. What are you guys doing? I mean, your coach is an idiot. Fire him. Um, I mean, Stephon, the Vikings got more out of Stephon Diggs from the Bills than you guys got from than you guys got from uh, the Cardinals. and But that's going to help the Cardinals out a lot with that second-year quarterback, uh, Kyler Murray. And he's finally got his weapon, weapon to throw to, so watch out, Cardinals. And I'm going to be opening day season. was supposed to start today, but it's not because, you know, the coronavirus. And and so it starts... They're talking about it starting uh, June in June and then ending in November on November 25th. But it never ends on November 25th, so that's really interesting. Like, um, yeah, it, it usually ends at the start of November 2nd. And they're also talking about how there's going to be, they could they could set it up like NCAA March Madness, uh, that bracket, and have 30, all the 30 teams in a playoff format. Um, yeah, that's really interesting. And now for everybody out there, the first report of the coronavirus in Van Buren County was just reported a couple of days ago. And it's a 60-year-old woman. Uh, she's in stable condition. Um, and, yeah. Guys, I can't stress this enough. Just stay home. Okay, just stay home. Yeah. You don't need to go be going places and spreading germs around. Okay? So just quarantine. This will be all over soon if we're just in this together. All right. Uh, that's your daily news for today. Oh, one more thing. Uh, the Olympics for 2020 has been postponed to, uh, until uh, 2021. Yep. So that's your daily news. And now it's time for... Happy birthdays to celebrities. What song did I sing for you on your birthday this year? Uh, happy birthday, of course! Three actors, Alan Arkin, James Caan, Martin Short... And lead singer of Aerosmith, Steven Tyler, and country country singer, Kenny Chesney. Happy birthday to those five celebrities. Guys, that's gonna... I hope you guys like my video today, and that's gonna be a wrap for today. Have a good night, and make sure you hit a like, subscribe, and um, keep watching the videos. Thank you for watching this. Have a great night.